What is going on, everyone? Welcome to the Daily Wrap for Monday, the 20th of June, 2022. I got a lot to talk about today, so please listen up because there's a lot going on, a lot of weird stuff going on. Um, So let's talk. All right, so first of all, today, did a fun pre-stream podcast because today we were starting up my playthrough of Castlevania Anniversary Collection. Uh, on the pre-stream podcast, I gave a very in-depth look at my background with the Castlevania series, including my knowledge of the games over time, which ones I'd actually played, which ones I hadn't, and how I was very interested in finally getting around to playing these original Castlevania games for you guys on stream. So it was a pretty lengthy segment. It was pretty good. People seemed to enjoy it. Uh, then we started Castlevania Anniversary Collection, and basically the entire stream today, the first stream, was me playing Castlevania 1. I had never played this game before. I had heard so many things about it. I had heard about, oh, the, the hardest corridor in the game is the way leading to the death boss. The death boss is actually harder than the final boss and all this kind of stuff. Um, and it was all true. <laughs> Seriously. Like everything I had ever seen in a video about this game, anything anyone had told me about this game was absolutely true. This game was very difficult. The good news is, by the end of my first stream, I finished the game. I had to use some save states, admittedly. If I didn't use save states, it'd probably take me 20 hours to beat the game because you have to keep replaying the levels. Screw all that. It's modern times. Use save states, get to the boss, win, right? So, it was good. It was fun. It was entertaining. People had a good time. Support was okay. It wasn't amazing. It wasn't bad. It was kind of in the middle of the road, which is fine for a retro playthrough. I wasn't disappointed. Then I went to upload the videos. So, I'm starting to upload the videos, and... I'm queuing up all the videos to upload. The way it works on YouTube is you queue up all your videos at once. They all simultaneously upload. And you put all your data, metadata in. As I'm uploading, I'm noticing the pre-stream podcast has frozen at 5% uploaded. And it's not increasing anymore. I'm also noticing that my hard drive is going crazy. <laughs> okay? So I'm like, I don't know what's going on here. You know, I don't, I don't know what's happening. Um, the other videos are uploading fine. All the Castlevania gameplay, but just not the pre-stream podcast for some odd reason. Okay? So I cancel the upload entirely, and I start it over again. All right? Now I leave it. I go have dinner with my wife. All right? Do all the things I need to do between the streams. I come back. It's not uploaded. It's stuck at 5% again. It didn't upload. I don't know what's going on, because then I say, well, sometimes this happens if the video corrupts. All right? <clears throat> so just for the sake of argument. Let's see if this video corrupted. Let's try to play it. I try to play it. It works. In multiple video players, it works. Not just like like one. Two video players, I trust it. It works fine. So I have no idea why this video won't upload. So I said, well, rather than try to upload it a third time and have the same thing happen a third time, what I will do then is I will go to my stream archive that I have on YouTube, and I will edit that down because I have the whole stream archived on DSP Gaming behind the scenes set to private. I will now edit that down to just the pre-stream podcast segment. All right. I will rename the video. And then when it goes live, you guys will get to watch it. So as of right now, I had that set up as of 6.30 tonight. It is now 9.42 and it's still processing. Sucks because YouTube, when it does re-edit videos like this, it takes forever. Video editing on YouTube is incredibly unfeasible. It takes ridiculously long to do it for no good reason. Um, So... <clears throat> yeah, it will go live at some point. Will it go live overnight? Maybe. Maybe not. And the thing is, I know people want to watch this. People were coming into the late stream tonight saying, where's the pre-stream podcast? I was like, I'm sorry, guys. Something went wrong. I can't even explain it. If the video is not corrupted, YouTube just won't take it past 5%. I, I'm at a loss. I don't know what's happening with this thing. Now, in the meantime of all this happening... I start my second stream tonight of Skyrim Anniversary Edition. And I'm looking, and all the Castlevania videos that uploaded won't process properly. <laughs> I'm like, what? So that was like the double whammy. Not only would it not upload the pre-stream podcast, now the videos that did upload are stuck in, like, low resolution. Now, luckily, it's Castlevania. It's not super high-res gaming, so no one really cares. But still, I'm like, geez, this is like, what is happening today, right? It's like, again, it's like Murphy's Law. If something can go wrong, it will go wrong for some odd reason. Now, this all is all compounded by something that happened yesterday. So yesterday, after I had finished my first stream, I purposely had saved some time to do a private video because every month I have a few people who usually pledge enough to my Patreon, they earn a private video. And I usually film their private video and upload it, and then they watch it, and they, you know that, that's how they get their, their Patreon reward. 
So yesterday I spent time, a whole half hour, I set ahead after my stream to film and upload the video for a patron. The video corrupts. I spent a half an hour making it, okay? And I go to, okay, I'm going to go upload it. It won't upload. It's like glitching out, erroring. I go to play the video. Video's corrupted. Now I have to spend more time later in the week. I have to find another half an hour between the streams and stuff to do it again. It's like, so I got videos corrupting. I got videos that won't upload at all. And then I've got videos that upload but won't process properly. All within 24 hours. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I really don't. All right. What I will say is this. I hope it's not something with my PC. I hope my PC is not breaking and having issues because that's really going to suck if it's, if it's falling apart now. Because I'm not ready to buy a new one. I just, I just can't right now. I hope not. I guess we'll have to see if this continues, all right? The good news is Castlevania went great. Castlevania was a really good stream today. Had fun. Viewers had fun. Would have been great to have a little bit more support, but I'm not going to complain. It was still a very fun stream. We beat the whole first game in one go, okay? Tonight, Skyrim After Hours or Anniversary Edition, whatever you want to call it, I'm going to be honest with everyone. The game is absolutely, positively, now, overwear, overworn out its welcome. I've been playing this game for six months. Um, there was a time when people looked forward to it. They anticipated it. They were excited for Skyrim After Hours. Oh, we get to chill with Phil. Now it's like, I turn it on and half the people won't talk. They're disengaged. They're not talking to me at all. They're talking about their own conversations and things. You got the trolls coming in doing stupid shit. And I got to put up with that. Um, it's been like this for the last several streams. It's very weird because every once in a while I'll play Skyrim and all of a sudden everyone's happy. Everyone's engaged, positivity, and there's a ton of support too. And then all of a sudden, it'll slow down and no one will care about Skyrim for several streams. This has happened the past two streams where I've been trying to get through the Dawnguard DLC. And I, I, I say it like that. I'm not trying to rush through it or get through it. I'm enjoying it. One, one stream, I did the Soul Cairn. And then this stream, we went and got Oriel's bow and we finished it up. We fought Harkon. We did the big f showdown finale. It was fun. I liked it. But the viewers are not talking to me anymore. They're disengaged. And two... Skyrim streams in a row, support has been abysmally bad. Like, I'm not talking, oh, it was kind of slow. Last stream, I got 16 bucks. This stream, I think I made 33. And that was after having made a special tweet saying, hey, if you can come by and help. And then two people came by and tipped, you know, at the second half of the stream because I did that. It's obvious this playthrough, like I said, it's overstated. It's welcome. So here's the deal. We are basically, we, I did a couple more side missions tonight. I did the murder mystery quest in Windhelm, or Winterhold, excuse me. No, it is Windhelm. Yes, in Windhelm. And then we did a East East Asia shipping company or something like that. I don't even know what it was. We had to go fight some pirates. We did that. And basically, at this point, we've done everything meaningful in the game. The only thing I really want to do before we finish, I want to get all the, the Dragon Priest masks, because I remember that's something I did in my first playthrough 11 years ago. I want to do that. I want to get all the Dragon Priest masks, go to Labyrinthian, go through that portal, and do the finale, Okay. But outside of that, I think it's time to finish the playthrough. So when we play it again, and we might say, when am I playing it again? I'm not sure. Likely, maybe this coming weekend on a late stream. We'll see. But when I play it again, um, I think what we should do is just hunt down the remaining Dragon Priest. What I'll do is I'll go back to my house at, at uh, what is it? Uh, Hydraheim or whatever it's called. We'll see what Dragon Priest masks I have there. What's missing? I probably have like two or three missing. We'll seek them out. We'll look it up if we need to. We'll go seek them out. Find them. Do their quests. And uh, finish the Labyrinthian quest. And then I think we're just going to finish the plot of the story and, and call it call it a game. I mean, it's been 140 hours I've been playing it at this point. I think people are tired. A lot of people are saying, well, when are you going to play the this RPG? Or what about this RPG? And I'm like, we can't do an RPG till I beat Skyrim. I'm like, damn, you're still playing Skyrim? Dude, it's been six months. Finish Skyrim so you can do other stuff. So I hear you. So I think that's what we're going to do. So when we play it, it might actually be the final stream of Skyrim. If not, it's the next to last stream of Skyrim when I play it again, likely this coming weekend, okay? Now, tomorrow, we're going to be doing more Castlevania. Tomorrow, we're doing Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest. I hope people will help me because I know this is the most cryptic game in Castlevania history. If you don't know these really cryptic things to do, you can't beat it. It's a, it's a, basically it's an RPG slash puzzle game, having to know what item you know to go where. You buy this item, you go here, do this with this item. It's not straightforward like the other Castlevanias. So I hope some people will help me with that on stream so we can we can make progress and get through it. <clears throat> and then tomorrow night is Toy Story 2 continuing on. 
Um, it's been a fun playthrough so far. I'm looking forward to more. You guys loved it when I played it last night. So I'm definitely looking forward to two more hours of it tomorrow night. All right. I am not here on Wednesday. When I come back on Thursday, it's Sonic Origins premiering. That's going to be paired with likely the conclusion of Toy Story 2. Friday and Saturday, all day long, it's Capcom Fighting Collection. Offline gameplay on daytime streams, multiplayer at night. And then the weekend, you know, we'll see where it takes us. Probably more Sonic Origins. Like I said, maybe the conclusion is Skyrim. We'll see. All right. One final thing. If you see this video and know other videos, you're like, what's going on? My apologies. I may be having more technical difficulties. I hope not. I hope all the videos recorded fine tonight. I hope they upload fine tonight. I personally, I don't know what's happening causing these issues. So let's all have our fingers crossed, our arms crossed, that everything goes fine tonight and the videos go live. And I'll see you all tomorrow in the morning. Fair enough. Everyone, please have a good evening. I hope to see you tomorrow for the final streaming day of the week. Peace out and have a good night. Later, everybody. If I can find my cursor. Goodbye.